and a man's an empty kettle. This is actual footage of Dick Cheney's recent heart transplant. As you can see, the doctors are making the incision. There was a great deal of debate as to where to look for Mr. Cheney's heart and what they might find when opening him up. Here they have cut his sternum. Now they've inserted the clamps to spread apart the sternum so they can begin to remove the old heart and install the new heart. Here the doctors are reaching and knocking loose the old part. As you can see, it takes a claw hammer. The doctor is reaching in and grabbing the old heart. Yes, as expected, you can see that, in fact, Cheney didn't have a heart made of flesh, but rather a metal pump. The doctor is cleaning up the area to make sure there aren't little bits of different things you don't want to leave in there. It looks like he feels something. Yes. Yes. It's a little lump of coal. They had a new heart taken from an inmate at Guantanamo who was willing to sacrifice his life to save the vice president, saying that his life had little value compared to Cheney's. Now that heart will be given to a less deserving teenager in Duluth. The pump replacement turns out to be a relief to former Vice President Cheney. He was concerned about the effect a heart of flesh might have on his judgment, which proves that all things work together for good.